Hi, hello everyone. My name is Yuan. Here I will tell you about the human tiger in West Sumatra. In Lan Minang, tiger are called Datu or Inye and are believed to be the spirits of their ancestors. Datu was also the inspiration for mat- martial art there, namely Silat Tiger or Silat Tiger. They self-defense use a weapon called a crabbit which is a can of small knife, knife that represents a tiger's claw. There I of also meet the size the I factor who master tiger select can transform into a tiger in real. At the foot of Mount Krichi to be precise, people believe that the Sumatran tiger in the incarnation of a friend and warrior of the spirit of the ancestor. The people of Krichi are used to call in the big strip cat by the name Imau Serabat or Imau Ulubalang. People believe that the Sumatran tiger is a the protective figure for human from all from us evil that will that. They are also figure of forest guard and keep out any will animals that will enter residential areas on the basis. Residents are required to respect the Sumatran tiger. There is even a rule that any resident who enters the forest can say the word tiger. If you say him, people can only greet him as Dio, Dio, and Hantu. This greeting means protecting and a more metal figure because tiger are believed to have inhibited the cringy forest fears. Also, if a Sumatran tiger is now descending on a residential area, this indicates that someone has filed a prohibition or customary law and if the community find a dead tiger, they will perform a traditional ritual with the Naga tiger dance with intended to entertain the tiger spirit. The ritual also mean that human and tiger can still choices in nature in the Naga tiger ritual poetry is recited for three tiger called Mangku Gunorayo, Rinte Ujan Pane, and Ulubalang Tagea. The third tiger is believed to have an agreement with the ancestor of the Krinci people to maintain harmony in their life. So that a short story about tiger man that's all for me. See you next time. Bye.